Yes, people, and welcome back to the YouTube channel. Right now, we have the mod that you did not know you needed. And trust me, this mod is very lit. Shout out to my Twitch gang, because this mod came from someone in the Twitch. We was talking about it, saying that we need something different. We got to add a bit of pizzazz to the streams. And what have we done? We found a mod that gives you stadium effects, gives you commentators, and also gives you crowd chance and a lot more people. But before we get into the simple tutorial, guys, do make sure you are leaving a like. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you comment. Let me know what other type of videos you would love to see on this channel. Don't forget to follow all the social media platforms. Those links are in the description right now. Make sure you're following the TikTok. Make sure you're following the Twitter and the Twitch where I'm streaming Football Manager Monday to Friday, various different times. So make sure you are going over to the Twitch and looking at the schedule. At the moment, I am doing an online save with Amandem and I'm also doing a belonging save by myself. But let's stop wasting time and let's get into this tutorial right now, people. Let's go. And here we are straight into the tutorial. And first up, we're going to go to fmscout.com. We go over to add-ons and go down to more realistic FM24. Then we are going to scroll down and you'll see it right here. Match day experience. We are going to click audio match commentary patch. And that is literally it. Shout out to Mets FM for making this one because it is very useful. And very nice to see something a bit different, man. All we're going to do is hit download very simply, guys. Once we start downloading, you'll see it right here. It'll send you to another page and just click start to download manually. And there you have it, it has popped up. And then all we are going to do is hit the save or the download button very quickly. And it will start downloading as you can see right here. So once that file has been downloaded, guys, make sure you have WinRAR or some sort of file extractor. And we're gonna double click it quickly. You can see I have WinRAR open now. Close that and go straight into this FM24 folder. And we can see we now have two files. One file being called SI Match, and another file be called SI Match Viewer Dash PC dot FMF. So they're both FMF files. And all we're gonna do is literally hit the copy button for this file. So we're gonna copy files to the clipboard and let this finish. And I'm gonna show you guys where you're gonna put these two files. So you'll need to put these two files in a certain place. So what you're gonna do is head over to your C drive or whatever your football manager is. Then you're gonna go to program files right here. Then you're gonna scroll down to Steam. You're gonna go into Steam apps. You're gonna go to common. You're gonna find football manager 24. You're gonna go over to data. And then you are going to go, I am going so close to you lot. Oh, it's right here. There you can see it, thank the Lord, bruv, because I can't lie to you lot. I was thinking, bruv, I'm doing quite well actually finding out where to put these things without checking. But here it is. And you can see the two files right here si match.fmf and himf si match viewer dash pc.fmf so literally what we are going to do is we're going to copy these files and then paste them into here and that is literally it so guys just in case you do not actually like these match sounds or you want to take it back to normal what i would recommend is these two files right here I would first copy them and paste them somewhere in your documents or somewhere so you know worst comes to worst, you can always go back and change it. Then literally what I would do is I would highlight this, copy that and then paste it straight into there and that is literally it. Then we're gonna load into FM24 and we're gonna see if these match sounds are now working. Let's get straight into it. So obviously it's still copying again because I decided to click copy like an idiot. But it don't matter. We hit cop paste there and you can see right there, these destinations have two files with the same names and all you got to do is hit the replace. Obviously I've done it already so I don't need to do it again. But that is all you need to do. And then you load straight into FM24 and make sure your match sounds are on. I'm going to fast forward once my FM24 is loaded and show you guys exactly what it's looking like. Be right back in two seconds. Okay, and here we are with my Bologna save. Like I said, I'm doing it at the moment over on Twitch. Make sure you guys are following the Twitch and I'll see you guys over there when we get active in the save. You're going to see what I'm doing at the moment. It's not been too bad currently. Obviously, we've lost our first game versus Inter Milan, which was very annoying. But aside from that, we are unbeaten in the Serie A. Uh, currently sitting second in the league, two points behind Inter. So not the worst. Obviously, first season, I did sign uh, two players, I believe. I signed Batruna, obviously, to play in the 10. And we signed another guy who we sent on loan, obviously. But we weren't able to register him because you're only allowed to register two players in the Serie A or some malarkey. I don't know, bruv. His name is Luciano Rodriguez. Personally, I don't really rate him that highly. Obviously, I don't really like his mentals. But for £2 million and my stream were 
begging for me to sign this guy. Now she can, he doesn't even look that good, you lot, bro. The mentals ain't good enough for me. Obviously, he's got high determination, so he can improve a lot. But I wasn't feeling that. I have to prefer someone else. But you know what I said? I'm going to give the power to the people. And if he is a dud and he fails, it is on you guys. But anyways, that's the Twitch stream. So head over to the Twitch. But we're going to arrange a friendly because we are actually unable to play a match because we got um, international break. So I'm going to arrange a friendly quickly and we're going to manage that friendly and we'll see exactly what it is looking like, people. Let's put a little small team and then we'll get into the friendly. And then I'll fast forward into when the friendly actually starts guys bro so obviously in three days so be right back in two seconds people all right and the match is about to start so we're literally just gonna head straight in here we've just quick picked whatever let's submit the teams have i got the mat sounds on i don't think i do yep we turn on the mat sounds there you can see it we turn the volume down a little piece put it down to about two and let's see exactly what it's looking like all right cool we got to change the skin night bro, but i hate when fm does this why does it take so long to change skin obviously i guess it's a computer game but jesus christ bro I was going to be here for like four minutes just waiting for it to change skin. So until then, I'm just going to carry on yapping and yapping and yapping and yapping and yapping, people. Make sure you are following all the social media platforms. Those links are in the description. And I'll see you on the Twitch, guys, man, where the vibes are insane. You want to head over to the Twitch because trust me, I don't think you're catching a Twitch stream like this anywhere else, bro. Head over to the Twitch right now. Go follow. If you ain't got a Twitch account... Go make one, and I'm telling you now, you're not going to regret that decision. There you go. It's finally loaded. Yaps over. Let's get straight into the match, man. Let's see what's going on right here, bro. Line up. Teams are warming up. Please wait on that. There you can hear it. And there you can hear it. You lot already. You see what I'm saying? We got a little Premier League start to the match. Anyways, let's get straight into it right now. And we're going to hear the crowd going crazy. Sounds different, isn't it? Not bad. It's not bad. We'll skip straight into the match. Let's get the first highlight going. And they're going to hear the commentators going crazy, bruv. There you go. Commentator now. Hoisted Cross. towards the area. Oh. mighty close. <laughs> and you see what I like about it as well, you lot, yeah? Is that there's actually... Got, you're going to hear the ball moving as well. You can hear the ball touching someone's foot as well every single time. So once they pass, once they touch the ball, you hear the ball every time. Yeah, it's intense, this. One thing I would say as well with this mod, guys, is that you're not able to put it very, very fast. So I had an issue when I first started using it that I weren't able. So usually I play my FM on this speed right here. So two up from the middle one. But it did sound a bit off. The commentators were rushing their words and overlapping each other. So my chat then said, try turning down the match highlights. And that did work a treat. So I'll probably say the best bet is to play a medium. Me personally, I need it a bit faster than that. So I play it on this one. So it is a bit better. But yeah, that's literally it. But like i said people very simple tutorial let me know if you guys are going to use this one it's definitely one that you don't think you need but once you've actually got it in the game it's not bad and that relieves the pressure and that was nice but not quite the end product required you know what i mean it's not too shabby man it adds a different dynamic to the game makes it feel more a bit Looking immersive people man can we the get one where we score no we can't terribly vulnerable but they've got but yeah once you it. hear the goal same thing and just goal Commentator is going crazy. Fiddles it away. man. It's lit, though. Honestly, guys, man. Let's see if we can wait until a goal pops up for you lot so you lot can hear how the goal sounds. Ball out wide. Yeah, it's not looking good right now. The team ain't really playing for the manager, are they, you lot, bro? Thank you very much, Christensen. Let's go, boys. There you go. Play him. Ferguson. Come on. Puts his foot on the gas. Go on, lad. Ferguson. Batruna. Play, play there. Come on. Revier. Revier. To the left it goes. Christensen. Puts it in the mixer. Okay, Carlson. Impressive. You... Penalty! The it's a penalty. Hey, not bad. Ferguson, you got a bag. Just for the YouTube video, you have to bag, man. We need to hear it, Up bro. Steps, Mr. Dependable. Come on. Oh, brilliant goal! There you have it, you lot, man. Thunderbolt. There you have it, man. There you have it, guys. Man. This afternoon, Monday, Even got a little commentator Tuesday, talking Tuesday. and that. It's not bad, you lot, man. Anyway, once you pause it, obviously it stops in that, man. But guys, that has been the YouTube video. Like I said, it's a very simple tutorial. I don't want to waste you lot's time. Literally, I want you guys to be able to share it to people so they can do it straight away. No questions asked. None of this long stuff where I'm showing you guys things I don't really need to show you. But anyways, guys, don't forget to leave a like. Make sure you subscribe and comment. And I'll see you guys on the next YouTube video, man. Love people.